G'day YouTube. Today I'm just going to quickly show you a Google Earth alternative for Linux Mint 14. It's called Marble, as you can see here. Now it's pretty cool. Um, I'll just quickly show you some of the features and then I'll show you how to easily install it. So as you can see, it's, it's pretty cool. It's uh, somewhat reminiscent of uh, Google Earth and you can zoom in and out. Okay, to start off, you've got the uh, navigation features console there. And then you've got the legend that will tell you what everything means, which is great. Now moving on to map view, you will find you've got the regular atlas, but then you've also got things like the satellite view and uh, Earth at night, which I think is pretty cool, um, that sort of thing. Also, you've got a few other things like a plane map, precipitation, uh, temperature, and even historical map from something like 1689 or the uh, explored world at the time. So it's it's pretty cool. Look, there's Australia halfway there. And um, yeah, no, that's, that's pretty much it. Also, you can do some address routing, which is quite cool as well. So in order to uh, actually install this one, I'll show you what to do. So the best and easiest way to do it is to go to a terminal. So type Control-Alt-T to open up a terminal. And all you have to type in is sudo apt-get install marble m-a-r-b-l-e uh, hit enter throw in your password and uh, follow the prompts uh, yes or no that sort of thing uh, it takes about one or two hundred meg just depending on what packages you already have on Linux Mint 14 but uh, that's pretty much it guys uh, that, that's it also uh, probably a more concise way to actually install it is to type the same thing except at the end type in what, dash y so it automatically uh, accepts yes to all your packages that you want to download. So there you go, then hit enter and you're done. So that's pretty much it guys, that is a cool little alternative to um, to Google Earth on Linux Mint 14. I uh, hope you've enjoyed the video and if you have, please subscribe. Cheers.